welcome to Katie Fix. Will's here. Hi. Which means we're talking healthy recipes, but with a twist of fun. So it's not just about broccoli and chicken. It's not, mate. It's about flavour. We're doing something different. Do you know what? One way you can guarantee that you're eating healthy is to eat with colour. Make sure there is lots of colour on your plate and chances are you're going to be eating absolutely delicious things. What have you got for us today, Miss Picks? Nice, nice, Thanks. nice segue. Thanks. We are making taboulet. 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 Which is essentially a salad made of lovely grains and a few spices and flavours, but it's all about using really fresh ingredients and just having something that's a bit more interesting. When you say salad, it doesn't sound great, does it? No. Taboulet sounds fun. Right? So, really, really simple, and there's actually no cooking involved. It's just mixing together, really. That's good for me. Excellent. So, we've got ourselves a little hand processor. In here, we're going to go in with some beetroot. We've got there the equivalent of about three to four beetroots. I've then got about 200 grams of radish. So, what you've got here is these beetroot have actually been steamed um, and then put in a little bit of vinegar. Only a little bit though. Oh, is it all going to fit? I don't know, you tell me. <laughs> um, but She's the expert. How much are you learning about me as a behind the scenes chef? Um, I think you are. No complaints so far. Excellent, thank you. I'm going to go in with a little bit of red wine vinegar, just a teaspoon. I just love those tart, sharp flavours in things. I love it. Right, lid on, and we're going to see if we can chunk this up a little bit. Where is the lid? Oh, that one. Uh, no. I can't figure this out. Oh my goodness. That's all right. I'm going home. Oh, it's effective. Is it? Give it a little shake. shake. A little shake. Another little, little shake. shake. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm having a time with that, isn't yeah. I? Yeah. That's all right. Not everything goes smoothly in the Katie Picks kitchen. Right, what we're going to do is we're going to decant some of the beetroot as well and truly pulsed. Basically, with this, you want to shred it up. You want to shred it up and also get a little bit of pastiness in there too. So this is fine. Just coarse. Yay! So we're going to whack this into here. But we're not going to stop there. We're going to keep going, okay? So back into the, back into the blitzer. We're now going to go in with some fresh herbs. So we've got parsley, chives, and mint. Ooh, light mint. So if you can take a, a, like a handful of, of each, basically, with the mint, if you can pluck the leaves off. And to that, we're also going to add in one apple. I'm going to chuck the apple in there as well. Bit of lemon in there too. Lovely. Right, and then into that, we're also going to go in with a teaspoon of cumin as well. Lid on. Lid on. Let's blitz it. Ugh. Fabulous. So if you imagine, you've got the sourness from the vinegar in there, nice and tart, and you've got the spice coming through from the beetroot and the radishes. You've then got a sweetness coming in from the apple and a freshness coming in from the herbs. Lovely. Like, so many different exciting flavours there. It does actually smell amazing, to be fair. We're going to finish it off. That's how easy it is. Tin of chickpeas. And also, again, these sorts of pulses and everything are so fibrous and like bulky that this is going to fill you up really quickly. Some good protein, them chickpeas as well. Is there? Yeah. And We've then grains. got pui lentils and quinoa. Both like ready, easy. I've warmed them up because I do like a warm salad. I'm a warm salad kind of gal. I'm going to go straight in with those and then straight in with some quinoa as well. You do realise there's only two of us at the moment, don't you? That's a big old salad. Oh, I'm making lunch <laughs> for the next week. Meal prepping. Done. Yeah, yeah, because that's a thing now. Yeah. Fitness. I don't do it, but it's a thing. Well, you could with that. So that's literally our salad all in. We've just got to give it a really good stir now and then hit it up with a few more fresh leaves, a bit rougher chopped, and just taste it and just play with a balance of flavours. So if you'd like to do some stirring, I'm going to chop up a bit more of the old parsley, maybe some mint as well. Season, salt Always. and pepper. Got to be generous to the old salt and pepper. Another, another bit of lemon. Should always be lemon fresh. And the other great thing about lemon is it's a preservative. 
So it is going to help keep your salad on your face. A little bit, but I'm just going <laughs> to pretend like an absolute pro, like nothing happened. Let's just have a try. Go it's in. fresh, it's easy, let's hope it tastes all right. Very, very good. That's easy, isn't it? You season that lovely, haven't you? Thank you. Oh. What you get there from just one apple, it's a beautiful sweetness that cuts through all the tartness of the other ingredients. It brings, it's brought to life with the lemon and the fresh herbs. I can get that level of mint through there as well. A bit of spiciness from the chives. That's exciting. I'm and look at impressed. it. Look at the colour. Look at the colour of that. Like you would not be sad if that was in your lunchbox, would no, you? No, I'd be very happy. If you want some fantastic fitness tips alongside some fit recipes, then why don't you go head over to my Instagram where we've shot some fabulous routines or make sure you're following Revolution. Yes, which is... we've got two, two main accounts, Revolution underscore PTS and Revolution PTS City, all one word. Which is where I did my transformation, guys. Yeah. If you don't know what I'm talking about, hit the link in the description box. Until then, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for cooking Thanks with for me. having me, everybody. It's great to see you. Bye. Bye.